من بودم I'm good. It's already there. It's good. <laughs> you know how to put it on silent, darling? Hmm? You know how to put it on silent? No. It's the button on the left. Do you want me to do it? That's all right. It doesn't mind. It's okay for rings. Okay. Yeah. Um, so I, was, I was just saying... Then the panel of the system... I think it was actually prompted by the, by the need for A, TV screens, you know, things, the doors that had to open and close. Mm. Um, you know, getting in and out for Nick Whitlam. Mm. And so there were these, we had to have some sort of jointing system. Mm. Yeah. <coughs> and then the introduction of the yellow Jalgo Sienna columns uh, came as a kind of ornamentation. Uh, it's symmetrical on the two uh, east and west walls and semi kind of on the southern wall. Yeah. Well, it it kind of skips because I think well, on the left-hand side of this, a small bar in the center was the TV yes. screen. Yes. yes. And it, t it is, to me, it's regular on every wall. Yeah. It's just on the south wall, the western side, two panels are missing, and that's where the door is. Yes, and, but the module's the same. Yes. So yeah. we're on the left-hand side, it's a module and a half, and on the... Yeah. So it works. Yeah. And, and on... On, if I remember correctly, on the eastern side, only Nick Whitlam's door opened. Yes. On the southern side... On the southern side, there's the TV and the bar. Yes. And then on the western side, there's nothing. Nothing. And in, we well, didn't say the TV, isn't there an AV room behind that? I think there's, isn't, I think there's a room there beyond that mirrored wall there. Ah, uh, yes, because they can do back projection. Projection, yes. 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 And a screen came down over the northern glass there. Yes. Yes. So in those days, it would have been a projector. Yeah. And somebody would be setting it up and projecting there. Yeah, there's a lot, there's yeah. a lot of hocus pocus. Yes. Of equipment. Yes. Now it's this big. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It doesn't exist. Yeah. yeah. Now it's just it'd be a. The white panels themselves would then be <laughs> would be the screen. Yes. Yes. Yeah. It makes makes the detailing a lot easier. Yeah. The, um, uh, uh, let's wipe that up. I mean, uh, that, that centre panel would have, would, would have not had a joint in it. Yes, yes, yeah, exactly, yeah. yes. And then the, uh, tell us about the floor. That's got, you were saying, the ebony and the, the artist for the floor. And it, well, it's the same, it's the same timber as in the two offices on either side with a slightly more elaborate pattern. Mm. Uh, again, with uh, an inlaid Macassar ebony strip, which I think when it came to the corners had a little sort of deep square oh, detail yes. Yes. that turned around yes. like a kind of Greek key yes. or something. Yes. But it was, there was a kind of ornament. Yes as opposed to just, you know, a single joint. Yes. Um, and a luminous ceiling, mm -hmm. just so that mm, it became a kind of shadowless, all-white space. Mm. Um, going back to uh, the end,
end of the film 2001? Yes. 2001? Yes. Yes. Yep. Where it, there was this all white, yes. wonderful space. Yep. Which I, I, that's what I've always, I always make the association between those two because I haven't seen the, the, the original reference. I don't know the Hoffman room. I've always made those and, and that room, that 2000 room, 2001 room is so beautiful because it is really old and really new together in this white room and it's that light, the light the in the room. Last one. It be, and everything is white and blue yes. and it is totally shadowless. Yes, yes, yeah. yes, beautiful, yeah. beautiful. And this has that kind of yes. reference going back yes. back to it. Alas, yes. the floor does not blow. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, any, uh, George, do you think there's any... Um, in that, any any reference toward the Seagram building? Because remember, it had illuminated ceilings, or it was just in here. It was just the desire to have a shadowless room. Uh, I think it's more the movie yeah. in terms of the atmosphere. Maybe yeah. Yeah. I mean, looking up at the Seagram building. Yes, yeah. there was the illuminated ceiling that you saw. Yes. Um, yes. Yeah. And then with that with that ceiling, that a lot of time and effort was done again with Alec Fisher to get the distances right so there were no you couldn't see any lights. Because it's just fluoros up there, isn't it? It's just fluoros but there are two layers. Well, oh. there was a layer down at the ceiling level. Yes. And then there was another layer uh, that took any kind of dirt or bugs so you wouldn't get that stuff directly on the ceiling and have shadows. Okay. So you had sort of a, a I can't remember any of it, a space of three or four yeah. hundred or whatever uh, as a sort of protection. Yes. So anything, any, and that was also kind of very carefully sealed yes. so that nothing could actually get into that mm. space. So any kind of stuff. Yes. Uh, that inevitably can come through the ceiling space would be collected on the upper level. Yes. And what, what actually are the ceiling tiles? Are they perspex? I'm pretty sure they're acrylic. Acrylic, yeah. Rather than glass. Yes. Yes. I'm pretty sure they're acrylic. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then the, the carpet? Uh, the carpet? The carpet was originally when the 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 um, bank was being designed. They had a invited five or six artists to design carpets for the banking chamber. Oh yes. Um, yeah. This is organised by Eileen Shannon, yes. who was you know, working on the uh, sort of forming a collection. For the bank. Yes. And they had invited Alan Lee Jones and uh, Jenny Key and several other artists. Robert Jacks? Was Robert Jacks one of those? Because remember, he did the lift lobby. Was Robert Jacks, would, would he have been one or they came in later? I think he came later. Yeah. Um, but I know it was Jenny Key yep. and Alan Lee Jones. Um, and there was a series of different designs. Um, the carpet for the chairman's office was one of the sort of rejected designs for the banking chamber. And I can't remember whether this was, this was, this is an Alan Lee Jones one. Mm -hmm. Now I can't remember whether there was one of those, but maybe, maybe it was. Anyway, the, in terms of, it was manufactured in the States mm -hmm. and the whole expression of the design was something that was very painterly. And you, know, you had this sort of concept of sort of fresh, paint on the surface uh, in total contrast to some of the other Alan Lee shows mm. which had a 
more of a collage mm. quality to it. And when this was made, they really reproduced that beautiful sort of painterly quality mm. in, in making it. And there were silver lurex threads throughout it. So this, this particular carpet had a very sort of special quality mm. to it. I also like the contrast. The room's very ordered. And then, and then, and then painterly the paint floor. floor is actually very free. Yes. Yeah. 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 And the furniture there? I, um, it, the furniture, the desk, the the chairs are not known, and I cannot remember now who the manufacturer was. Um, and the table was a, a kind of ash, uh, just about the same veneer the same timber as the floor, mm -hmm. same mm -hmm. color, same type. Mm -hmm. um, and now I can't remember whether it was our design or a manufacturing table. I yeah. actually cannot remember. Yeah. Yeah. I, know, I know it was just a table rather than a column yes. interrupting the carpet. It's got four legs, yeah. yeah. So if we go to the, um, let's go to the back one, that one there, to talk about the ante room. Uh, the ante room, see that's all, it's all black, it's total contrast to the room itself. You come into a space with black charter pack glass yeah. walls, yeah. Yeah. Um, and again an illuminated ceiling. Glass yes. walls and black carpet. Yes. So it's a completely negative mirrored, a negative and mirrored space. So you, it's goes on yes. to infinity. Yes. Um, and where the uh, inlay, the inlay in the conference room is a pale timber with a dark inlay this is a black carpet with a white yeah. inlay and the same line comes in um, from this sort of chair rail in the uh, panel system in the conference room enters into this space and it stops at kind of door jam corner yeah uh, and then the corner sort of go up uh, divides itself from large white panels to small white yes. panels interrupted with black, so it changes scale like a, a um, thermometer or a su surveyor stick. stick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. And the um, and the uh, and 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 that also to remember that's Chotapak glass. I don't think. Um, colour back glass was common then. Now later we'll talk about the blue corridor because I think you were one of the first people that took it from kitchen cooktops. No, from just... spandrel glass. Spandrel glass, yeah. Is where it came from originally. Right. Um, I'm pretty sure this was this was Chotapak. Yes. Which was a sort of black all the way through. Exactly, as opposed to being on the back yeah, surface. Yeah. Yes. And so it had a very different different kind of reflective quality yes. because the the reflection was on the surface yes. as opposed to being on the back face. Yes, yes, yeah. Yes. Which gave it a totally different look. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And then but no, I, I, again I love the foil between the room and this ante room. The black the, the blacks change to the white and vice versa. And also to me the order has been questioned here because of the mirrors. There's an order, but it all just disappears off. Now, see, that's a pivot door. Yes. That's, that's the mirror door. I'm pretty sure that was the AV room in there. Okay. But you, because it's a mirror door, you see beyond that. You're not seeing it. You're not seeing it's a door. And in there was the, um, the sculpture, Richard Goodwin. Here. Yes, <laughs> exactly. Yes. Now that's interesting. That is 
That is the mirror. That is the panel. A glass. A glass. Yeah, black glass. Yes. Okay, and that's yeah, and that's the opening. That's that opening. Yes. Here. Yes. That's that. That's that opening. They're reflected in that. Yes. Yes. Yep. Yep. And then this is actually the wall here. See, so that's actually a wall there. Yes. But the mirror works on there as well. That's why you get two pivots because you can see the ceiling coming in at the top there. Actually, it's not the ceiling. It's that reflective Because that's only that's the width of the. Yeah. yeah. That's all the room. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. That's nice. Okay. Um, then, then outside there is. It wasn't really just the door. The the room was only the door bit. Yes. Yeah. But it looks a lot bigger, and yeah. there's that lovely fantasy when you go in there. A scene here is a picture of the. So that's the corridor outside. Remember the stair going up to the dining room. Yeah. And then there are these four coloured recesses. And that was the entrance to Nick's office. Yes. Yes. Uh, which way did the stair go? You're right. Yes. Yes. That quite, was quite, yes. That's right. Yep. And the secretaries were there. Yes. And this entrance was under here. Yes. That's right. Yes. Yeah. Yes. And then this this is this is a space that gets these guys up to the dining room. That was its primary purpose. Oh no, to the chairman, was it? What was the reason for that stair? That went up to the boardroom. Yes. Boardroom, chairman. Chairman's office. And dining rooms? Could they? Yeah, they could go through. Yeah, yeah because the dining room was in that. Yes. The dining room was in the northeast corner. Yep. The boardroom was in the center. Yes. Facing due north. And the chairman was in the northwest corner. Yes. Yes. Yep. Yeah. And in this, I, I think. Wasn't there a secret door amongst this? Was the door that went into the private conference room? That's the door. That's the door. Ah, okay, beautiful. Yeah. yeah. That's the door. <laughs> yeah, beautiful. The sneaky buggers. Yes, and it'll be a heavy door. There's a lot yeah. of detailing in that. Yes. Yeah, that's that door. Yes, yes. And then these, then these four recesses. Remember the four plastered recess? With one opposite each other, and they had light, sort of funny light fittings that we had designed yes, that's from right. four different light fittings. Yeah. Sort of kooky yeah. little fanciful things, all in the kind of um, Memphis yes. inspired. Yeah ornamentation yeah. from memory. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. And four different colours, weren't they? Four different colours, four different forms. Yes, yeah. And that remember the plasterer Yogi I think his name was? Remember he got that he was a master of getting well, it mirror like. Those he did that that stair. Yeah. And yes. he did the chairman's um, comfort room for it. Yes. Yes, that's right. Okay, yes. Those those spaces. Yes. Yeah. And then, mm -hmm. Let me just turn this off, George. I'll just it's gonna stop.